Good morning students. Dear students, today we will learn how to solve statement sums of page 64 from your maths book. Sum number 1. Tejas had rupees 563 in his piggy bank. 563 rupees. His father gave him rupees 278 more. How many rupees Tejas has? Now, let's count 563, 600, 63, 763, 773, 783, 793, 803, 813, 823, 833, 834, 835, 836, 837, 838, 839, 840 and 841. Yes, they just has now 841 rupees. Dear students, by using second method, we will solve it like this. They just had rupees 563 in his piggy bank. Means 3 notes of rupees 1 means 3 at 1's place. And 6 notes of rupees 10 means 60 rupees and 60 rupees means 6 tens. 5 notes of rupees 100 means 500 rupees and 500 rupees means 5 at 100's place. His father gave him 278 rupees more means 8 notes of rupees. 1 means 8 rupees and 8 rupees means 8 ones. And 70 rupees means 7 notes of rupees 10. And 70 rupees means 7 at 10's place. And 2 notes of rupees 100 means 200 rupees. And 200 rupees means 2 at 100's place. So, Tejas has now rupees. Firstly, we will count 1 rupees notes. And here we have 11 notes of rupees 1. So here they just will take yes one note of rupees 10 in place of 10 notes of rupees 1 because 10 ones is equal to 1 tens. So 1 at tens place. Now we have only one note of rupees 1 means 1 at ones place. Now we have 14 notes of rupees. 10 means 140 rupees and 140 rupees means 14 tens. So here they just will take yes one note of rupees 100 in place of 10 notes of rupees 10 because dear students 100 is equal to 10 tens. So 1 at 100's place and now we have 4 notes of rupees 10 means 40 rupees and 40 rupees means 4 tens. And now we have 8 notes of rupees 100 means 800 rupees and 800 rupees means 8 at 100's place. So my dear students, Tejas has now rupees 841. Sum number 2, Paneet has rupees 600. 80. He bought a bag for rupees 575. How many rupees is he left with? Now, to pay for the price of bag, Paneet will firstly give to the shopkeeper, yes, 500 rupees. Then, he will give 70 rupees to the shopkeeper, means 570 rupees. And now, to give 5 rupees to the shopkeeper, Parmeet will take, yes, 10 notes of rupees 1 in place of 1 note of rupees 10. And now, Parmeet will easily give 5 rupees to the shopkeeper. So, dear students, let's see how much money is left with Parmeet. 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 100. Five. Yes. And we get the answer for our question 
that is 680 minus 575 is equal to 105. Students, in the notebooks we can solve it like this. Paneet has rupees 680. He bought a bag for rupees 575. And now he is left with rupees 105. In the homework, dear students, do statement sums from 7 to 12 given at page 64 of your maths book in your notebooks. Thank you.